But let's start at home tonight where it is the night. Rockin' on the River becomes Vaxin' on the River as the concert venue, Lorraine County Public Health, Mercy Health, and the City of Lorraine all partner not only to get people vaccinated, but also to give them a great night of entertainment to boot. But the timing of this is important because the Delta variant is spreading like wildfire across Ohio. Yesterday, we found out about a new Lambda variant that's now in the U.S. Senior health correspondent Monica Robbins joins us live from Black River Landing with more on how this event, Monica, I'm going to go there. It's going to rock the needle. <laughs> yeah, it absolutely is. You know, Lorraine Public Health is set up behind me, ready to give vaccinations. They weren't supposed to start giving them until 5 o'clock. They've already given out five vaccines so far. People are just walking up, getting their first dose. Rock legend, of course, Lita Ford, the headliner tonight. She is set to st take the stage tonight at 830. And of course, anybody who comes and shows their vaccination card or gets their first dose right here gets into the concert for free. They also get a $10 gift card from the city of Lorraine. This was all an idea that uh, Bob Early, the concert promoter for Rocket on the River, he came up with and it was really, really really easy to get everybody on board. And of course, it wasn't hard to uh, set this all up as well. Now, the timing, like you said, Bets, it's really important because vaccination levels are declining as the Delta variant is becoming the predominant mutation, causing those cases to rise. So I asked Lorraine County Deputy Health Commissioner Mark Adams about what his concerns are for the coming months. Those lessons, and that is, there is a there, to wash your hands again, to clean services, to keep a little distance. Don't go to work when you're sick. Don't go to school when you're sick. Uh, to not lose those things, because I don't want to see the, the flu numbers go up. None of us do, because that really can have an impact among the population where COVID is not really infect is really having an impact as much with that younger group. The flu still has. So Adams hopes anybody who might be on the fence about getting the vaccine will at least come down and talk to him about it. He's here ready to answer questions and they are prepared for those people who just show up and make the decision to get the vaccine because it's really convenient right here. Lita Ford is also aware all of this is taking place and she's expected to get here in about an hour or so before showtime. And I did speak to the opener, Michael Weber, who uh, is doing his sound check right now on stage. He's absolutely amazing, but he brought up a great point. He said COVID decimated his touring schedule last year, and he is just so grateful for everybody who did get the vaccine because it put him back to work. So again, if you come down, you are vaccinated, bring your vaccination card, you show it at the gate, you get a hand stamp, you also get a $10 gift card, or you can come here and get your vaccine. They're waiting and ready for you with all three types of vaccines ready to hand out. I've already talked to a couple of people who who uh, got their vaccinations and then a couple of people who chose, you know what, I'm going to pay the 10 bucks to come in the door because I just want to see Lita Ford. Everybody is welcome. Doesn't matter, but this is a night to party and celebrate the vaccination effort and hopefully it'll make a big difference. But you know, we do have to keep in mind what's coming in the fall. That's we, we definitely do. And I love to hear that. Wash your hands, wash your hands, wash your hands. We have not forgotten Monica <laughs> Robbins. Thank you. And <laughs> I'll be I'll be repeating it ad nauseum. You I know, know you will, of course. <laughs> and when you tell Lita Ford that, make sure you get it on tape because I want to see that conversation go down. Oh, Don't fangirl too I hard, think I girlfriend. Could do that. <laughs> All right, Monica, thanks a lot.